and you stack those wins, like if you say, hey, I made a commitment to prospect for two hours a day and you hit those two hours, well, you gotta reward yourself. You start stacking these wins over and over, you start to gain that confidence back. You start to gain that motivation back and it's ultimately gonna put you in momentum. So what do you do when sales are down, you feel stuck, you're not motivated, and you're in a slump and you just wanna get out of it and move forward. Guys, if you are in the real estate industry right now, you know that sales are down for many, many agents all across the board. The market's tough, interest rates are higher, buyers are on the fence, sellers are on the fence. It's just a lot harder to get transactions to go through. And the reality is a lot of agents aren't performing at the level of closed sales or commissions generated that they did last year or the year previous. And what's happening is things that I notice, even in my role as a team leader and a mentor to a lot of different agents, is that people can oftentimes get in a slump. You know, they feel unmotivated. You know, they're just sad or, you know, about the sales and stuff like that. And it cripples them sometimes from actually getting out there and doing the work. So I want to give you guys, you know, something to think about if this is you and you're in that position or you're just oftentimes not feeling motivated. You need to think about how you are measuring your success. If you are only measuring your success by how many sales you close or how much commission you generate and sales are down or the whole industry is down, well, that's going to be a tough battle, right? Because you're always comparing yourself to what happened before. And when you get in that comparison mode and you realize you're not just performing at where you want to be or where you were at before, that can really bring you down. So the challenge that I have for you if you're watching this and you may be experiencing this is you need to readjust how you're measuring your success. Start thinking about what you can measure every single week that is gonna allow you to score some wins and put some points on the board and prove to yourself that you can get through this. Uh, what we do on our team is we like to track the activities every single week that will bring in sales, right? So we track like how many times we came to training, how many hours we prospected, how many times we promoted ourselves on social media, how many appointments we set or how many clients we met with, how many offers we wrote, how many homes did we show. And we're essentially tracking the different activities that will ultimately lead to sales. And so we're, we're changing the scorecard, right? So that our team can be more focused on the activities versus focused on just the end result. Yes, the end result is important. Yes, we wanna close sales, but it's all of these daily activities that ultimately lead to the sales. So if you change your focus to just focusing on what is in your control, the things that you can do on a daily basis, on a weekly basis, and that's gonna move the needle forward, that gives you an opportunity to actually count some wins. And when you stack those wins, like if you say, hey, I made a commitment to prospect for two hours a day and you hit those two hours, well, you gotta reward yourself, right? You gotta give yourself some props. You gotta acknowledge that and, and take the win. If you said, I'm gonna post on social media and you did that, that's a win right there. And what happens is if you start stacking these wins over and over, you start to gain that confidence back. You start to gain that uh, motivation back and it's ultimately gonna put you in momentum and this business is all about momentum. So I, I challenge you and I encourage you if you are going through a slump or you're not feeling as motivated as you were before, think about what is in your control today. What are things that you can do on a daily basis that will add up and lead to the results and give yourself credit for your work. Try that guys, put that into your business and I promise you, little by little, it'll turn things around, it'll get that motivation back, you'll get your groove back and you will be on your way to success. Guys, I hope that sits with you well, I hope you got something out of that. If you need any coaching, any advice, I'm offering free one-on-one -on -one coaching sessions, go to meetenrique.com. I'd love to connect with you. This is my way of giving back to the industry and building relationships, quite honestly. I can point you in the right direction. I can show you what some of our, our team is doing, some of the guys on our team are doing to win and have success in this market and see if that can help you out, guys. Talk to you soon.